What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 4 video here for you guys on the channel. So basically where we left off in the last video, uh, we had joined the Brotherhood of Steel officially, uh, met uh, Elder Maxon and everybody, and of course now we have to go meet the entire crew. So that's basically where we're at in the Brotherhood of Steel questline. So we're going to do that and see where that potentially leads us. If you're excited for this video, do me a huge favor, drop a like on the video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get going. All right. So is there somebody over here? Yeah, there's a couple people over here. I kind of want to get out of the power armor, though. At least temporarily. Here, let's, let's do this. Since we have to come this way to leave... Let's just get out of our power armor right there. Alright, let's talk to homeboy first. Hello. Captain. Glad you finally stopped by, soldier. Are you ready for your medical exam? If you say so. Uh, medical exam? What kind of medical exam? I feel fine. There's nothing to be alarmed about. I just have a few simple questions about your medical history. It's my responsibility to make sure that you don't bring anything up here that could pose a threat to the crew. And yet I'm already up here. I'm ask you a series of medical-related questions, and I'd like you to answer me to the best of your ability. First question. As a child, were you ever exposed to radiation for an extended period of time? Um... There wasn't really much before the war, you know? So, I would say no. There wasn't that much radiation around before the bombs fell. Before the bombs? What? L let me check my notes. You were a vault dweller? You're probably healthier than anyone else aboard. I know. Anyway, sorry I missed that in your records. Just going down the list of questions. I'm sure you understand. No, I do. Okay. You're good. Okay, second question. Have you ever had or come in contact with a person confirmed to be carrying a communicable disease? Um, no, not that I remember, no. Never been seriously sick in my life. Good, good. Third question, and please answer honestly. Have you ever had sexual relations with any species considered non-human? <laughs> uh, uh, no. <laughs> uh, no, never had. Very well. Last question. <laughs> Would you have any so problems stupid. pulling the trigger on an enemy of the Brotherhood, whether they're human, formerly human, or machine? Uh, I mean, if I have to defend myself, I definitely have no problems with that. If my life's in danger, I'll do whatever it takes to defend myself. That's an acceptable answer, and the most common. Excellent. I think I've got all the information I need. I see no reason to prevent you from beginning your duties immediately. If you ever need medical assistance, you let me know. Sounds good. Thank you, Knight Captain Cade. Uh, you. Ah, oh, good. You're finally here. Just set the books down anywhere. I'll get to them as soon as I can. We you talking about, Proctor Quinlan? Um, I think you might be confusing me with somebody else. I think you're confusing me with someone else. Hmm. Perhaps I need to rummage through the supply bins for a new pair of glasses. Since it's obvious that you aren't who I was expecting, <clears throat> would you mind telling me why you're here? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, just meeting the crew. Maxon wanted me to meet the crew, so you were next on my list. Ah, yes. You must be the new recruit described in Paladin Dance's report. Under normal circumstances, I'd provide you with a proper orientation of my department. However, I'm woefully behind setting up research patrols and getting bombarded with requests for technical documentation. Unfortunately, I'm lacking the personnel needed to get the job done. Uh, I mean, I suppose I could help you out with that. Maybe I can lend you a hand. That would be splendid. As you patrol the Commonwealth, keep your eyes open for blueprints, memos, manuals, books, charts. Anything containing useful technical data. I'm authorized to pay you for each bundle of documents that you recover. And if you wish to be assigned to a research patrol, I have plenty of them waiting to be filled. In any event, it was a pleasure to meet you, Knight. Why, thank you, uh, Proctor Quidlin. I think I have two more to go. Um, do I have the Brotherhood Fatigues? Or not the Brotherhood Fatigues, the uh, the one with the uh, 
the jacket. I forgot what it's called, actually. I probably put it away. Uh. Sure. Alright. Hello. So, you're the new recruit I heard about. Huh, not what I was expecting. Uh, you sound a little disappointing. Disappointed. Sounds like you're disappointed. I'm not disappointed, just surprised. You don't look like one of the usual wastelanders we pick up. Anyway, since you came down here to meet me, we may as well get it over <coughs> with. My name's Ingram, and this lovely little grease pit is where you'll usually find me. If your power armor's too tight in the crotch, the Pridwin's about to crash into the ground, or a robot's gone haywire, you come see me. Um... What about power armor? Is this where I get my power armor? Ha! <laughs> That's always the first question from the new guys. <laughs> I already got see. it, by the way. I just fixed up a pretty decent T-60 suit. The left leg actuator's a bit sticky, but it'll keep the creeps off of you. It's sitting in Bay 3. There isn't a day that goes by on this tub without five or six things breaking down. And since I'm stuck in this rig, I'm not quite as spry as I used to be. The work tends to pile up. I get it. Uh, seem to be getting around, uh, around pretty well, actually. Actually, you seem to be getting around really well. I suppose it's better than the alternative. Anyway, if you need any work done on your power armor, feel free to use the workshops around here. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to get back to work. Yes, ma'am. I think I have one more left to talk to. Let's what's in here. Plasma cartridge. I'll take that. Thank you very much. And now let's talk to you. Hello. Excuse me, Proctor Teagan. Step forward, Knight. Even though they've locked me in this blasted cage, I promise that I won't find it. Uh... Yeah, it looks uncomfortable in there. It looks uncomfortable in there. It's not that bad. Now, this is the stowage depot. And I, as you probably already guessed, am the ship's quartermaster, Proctor Tegan. <clears throat> the powers that be have me locked in here, so I can keep an eye on the Brotherhood's valuables. If you need to stock up on supplies before you head out on a mission, this is the place to buy them. Uh... Yeah, okay, that's good to know, man. That's good to know. I'm glad you're the agreeable type. When I tell most of the new recruits that they have to buy their own equipment, they give me the stink eye. The good news is by having a constant flow of caps, I'm able to buy whatever you bring me. Yeah, I'm mostly interested in weapons, but I'll take anything useful. Of course, if you're just looking to make a few caps on the side, I might have some extra work for you to do. Uh... What do you mean? What kind of extra work? What sort of extra work are we talking about? Oh, no, 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 no. It's nothing like you're thinking. It just involves a little bit of heavy lifting and interacting with the local farms. And since I'm stuck up here manning this one-man zoo, I need someone to do the legwork for me. After you're done with the meet and greet, we can discuss the details. In the meantime, if you ever need anything else, gun, Mod, even ammo. You just let me know. Oh, okay, cool. Late for muster one more time. Captain Kells is gonna have me do a hundred push-ups. If you say so. Uh, I want to talk to him as soon as the quest updates, cause I wanna. There we go. Tegan. What brings you to me today? Uh, I wanna buy your shit. Set me up. <laughs> Be my guest. He's got a couple of legendary, unique things here. Ooh, combat armor. Uh, where is it? Is this the regular one? Yeah, that's the regular. Commando chess piece. Uh, sure. Sure. Uh, he also sells, um... Some legendary... Power armor pieces. So that's good to have. Obviously, I don't need it right now, but hold on. What's the mission right now? The mission is uh, data. Meet with Elder Maxon. Will do, sir, ma'am, yeah, you, whatever. Let's go. I kind of want to steal this. All right, let's see if what's-his-name hates us for it. 
<laughs> Alright, I don't care. I'm tempted to just put it on right now. I think I already have it though, but hey, whatever. It is what it is. Let's get back inside here though. Good thing is that he doesn't hate me. And I think he likes it when I jump into power armor too, so... Yeah, see? Good. So I'm not too worried at the fact that he hated that I pickpocketed that girl. Now she's running around naked. <laughs> Alright, where is Maxon? I believe he's outside on the deck. And then he's all the way at the end of the, the deck or whatever. There's like a lot of unusable, un unused space in... On the Pridwin, I think. And the player home in the Pridwin, I think, is so bad. It's such a bad place. I don't like it at all. I wish every uh, faction had a good, you know, player home or whatever. But realistically, the only one that's worth a damn is the uh, Minutemen, since you can actually build it to your content. But. Yeah, there's nothing really spectacular about any of the other ones like the railroad or yourself with the Pridwin's crew. Or these guys. Are you ready for your next assignment, brother? Yeah, of course. Let's just yeah, sure. Good. Let's get right to it then. Shall we? Take a look mm, over. Sure. There. That's Fort Strong. And it's infested with super mutants. Gas. Having those aberrations of nature close enough to smell is making me sick to my stomach. To make matters worse. They're sitting on top of a massive stockpile of fat man shells we could use in our campaign. I want you to head over there, wipe out everything that moves, and secure that stockpile. Understood? Uh... Yeah, sure. Consider it done, man. Consider it done. Look, I realize you're eager to take the fight to the Institute, but it'll have to wait. The Brotherhood cannot allow those abominations to have a nuclear arsenal at their fingertips. It'll be a pleasure to exterminate them. Now, damn, we have a all right, on standby, fully armed and ready to depart. Use it to carry our message to Fort Strong and wipe those dirty mutants from the face of the earth. Dismissed, yes, ma'am. Uh, board of the Verde Bird ship. I kind of want to go. Uh, hold on, what am I doing? Let's go here first just to drop off this power armor. Luckily, it's just right here, so it should be a relatively quick loading screen, I believe. I hope, at least. Any minute now. <laughs> Come on, baby. Maybe this wasn't a great idea. One thing's for sure, I definitely don't want to be a power armor. I'm not a power armor user, man. I love power armor, but I don't like using it. I feel like it's very clunky, very slow. I don't know. Yeah, you get pretty good damage resistance. But even with that, I don't really like power armor. At least using power armor, I should say. But I know what the intrigue is with power armor. Like, I know why people like it. I know why people like to use them. Uh, again, I'll say this again. Personally, I don't like using it. Sure. Alright, first things first, though. Let's go over here. Hold on, really quick. Let's, uh, get out. Then I'll take that fusion core. And let's go and destroy everything real quick. I kind of like the rugs there, so I'm keeping the rugs there. Let's go. This could go away too. Don't need a trash can. That's just going to go all crazy once I bring people here. If I bring people here. Let me know if you guys want to see some settlement building stuff. I wouldn't consider myself like a great, you know, settlement builder, but I do like doing it. You know what I mean? It is pretty fun. All right, let's get rid of all the stuff we don't need, though. Like all of this. Whoa. 
Let's go. I don't need any of this, so I'm not really worried about it. All right. Good in that department. There's so much. It's insane. This place is so dirty. It's not even funny. Uh, all right. Let's get rid of all of that. I think that's all we got on that side. I'm going to keep the rugs there for now. Uh, I do want some turrets, though, to protect this place. Oh, I need oil. Oh. Crap. Can I build this? I, I don't see a purpose for that. All uh, right, you know what? <clears throat> we'll do the actual building later. Oh, wait. I see something that I need to scrap. Can I scrap this? No. All right. It is what it is. Let's scrap this. Take a quick look around. All right, we're good. Let's go back onto the Pridwin then. Now that this place is clean and secure and now belongs to me. Maybe at some point I'll set up a supply line over here because I kind of need it so I can build stuff, you know what I mean? But now I gotta wait for it to load the Pridwin. So this, in theory, should be pretty quick since it's still an exterior, but it's a small piece of an exterior. I don't know. We'll see. The good thing is that we already claimed Boston Airport and scrapped everything. So if you guys want to see a you know settlement building air uh, th video, let me know. Maybe when we're done with the let's play, we'll do a little bit of uh, some settlement building. Is that it? Hold on, let me uh, remove that marker. I could have sworn it's over here though. Is it not here? Yeah, that goes to the airport. What about this over here? This go right vertebrate. All right, let's do this. Welcome aboard, Knight. Instruments are green, and we're cleared for release. Nice. Where are we headed? Well, obviously Fort Strong, but still. Look at the Brotherhood base. This looks badass, dude. I don't care what anybody says. Let's get down to business. Oh, that's one of our settlements, I think. Nordhagen Beach, maybe, I think it's what it's called. Alright, let's do this. All you super mutant scum are going Target to be required. deceased. I'll try and keep him in your sights. Oh snap, it's a behemoth. Let's go. Ow. Come on, baby. Would you stay still? I need to kill you, man. We're gonna die. Oh my god, dude. I mean, I guess I could take out some of these other guys. Let's go, he's almost dead. Oh god, he's almost dead. Let's go. Dunskies. Uh, where's all these other guys? Alright, sure, whatever. Where are they? I don't see them. Well, there's one right here. Come on. Let's go. He's dead. Let's take our homeboy real quick. Yo, this is intense. 
We're like walking through these guys. I'm not scared of you. For Narnia! You, die. <laughs> I should have, I should have saved it. Oh no, you know what? I don't like it. We're doing this again. Oh no, we're not. Fuck it. Oh snap, maybe I should uh take a stim pack. Where are they at? Oh wait, I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Let's uh blast his head off. Oh shit. That's not good at all. And I don't think he's mutated yet either. Oh snap. Well, good thing is that he's mutated. Oh fuck. Ah! I'm scared! Alright, I'm ready for you, big guy. Come on. Ah! You ready? Let's go. Oh, come on. There we go. Troubleshooter's combat armor. Put it. I don't... Uh, I'm not worried about it. Let's go. Is everybody dead? I think everyone's dead. Let's find that superhuman behemoth. He's around here somewhere. Where the hell did I kill him, though? Oh, he's right here. I see him. I'll take that, 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 that. Um... Yeah, all right, we're good. Let's go. All right, let's go ahead and heal, actually, now that we got an opportunity. Because there's more trouble on the inside. Let's do this stealthily. Hope you're ready, Paladin Dance. Because it's time to dance. And it's an interior, so it should load pretty quickly. <clears throat> it's a good thing. Because normally it takes like forever to load. Well, that's an interesting sight right there. Alright. Nope. Alright, let's just KO him. Oh god, there's a legendary in here too. Quiet. And I smell your ass. Let's go. Good. Oh, hello. Actually, the legs are pretty perfect. Let's continue to do the stealth, even though we've already been discovered. Just in case we go back into stealth. Wait, where are they? Okay, this way. He's got a laser rifle, too. Oh, shit. Come on. I hope we break his leg. Let's go. One more. That's all I got. Well, at least he mutated. Oh, snap. Let's chill for a second. Give me my freaking stuff back. All right, let's go. Oh, fuck. Headshot. Uh, nope. Leg shots. I'm going to continue hitting the same leg. Come 
Come on. Paladin Dance is a monster. He's just standing there like it's nothing. Ready. Do I have any grenades? Come on, let's do this. At least, the, at least the legendary guy is almost dead. Oh. Die! What happened to Dance? Is he dead? Come on. Hello. Nice of you to join the fight. Let's check out this legendary real quick. Hey, he's got nothing special. Let's go. Where'd he go? Did he die? I think Dance killed him. Yeah, I think Dance killed him. Cool. Let's just uh, explore really fast before we actually go to where we're supposed to go. Don't tell me what to do. Uh, novice. Sure, why not? Oh, I thought that was it. Let's go. That's it. Let's grab all of this. Uh, nothing that I really care for. Mini nuke. Sure, why not? Four strong key. I'll be taking that. And covert operations. Per permanently more difficult to detect while sneaking. Uh, and I got an achievement for that. No shit, dance. Let's unlock that while we got an opportunity. And since we're done, we don't really have to sneak right now. Let's go down here, though. Bingo! See you later, dance. He's probably gonna be outside the elevator. He always is. He's weird like that. Any minute now. This is a very long elevator ride. Oh, hello, Dance. Nice that you stop by. What's in here? Fusion cells, don't mind if I do. Sure, two millimeter EC. I suppose we'll take it. Anybody in here? Nope. Anybody in here? Nope. Got my way, dance. Do I have grenades? Um. I mean, nothing spectacular, I guess, but. Alright, let's see if we can, uh. Good. Got the drop on him. Dunskis. Alright, let's get another grenade. There isn't much left. Because I think there's somebody in there. He's in there, but I guess I didn't get him. Die! Literally point blank to his chest. You die. I'm experiencing some radiation. Oh, God. All right, let's take homeboy out first. Let's go. Fuck, dude. This is going to be another hard one. Come on. Let's go. Oh shit, I need to take out this guy. 
Homeboy has a freaking rocket launcher. Ah, yeah, fuck it, I'll take out this guy too. Fuck me. Let's go. Get out of the way. Oh, snap. Uh, you know what? Do I have another? I do. I hope that was enough. Fuck me, it wasn't. I missed. Uh, fuck it. Let's go. Okay, so I got no more. Let's take one of these and one of these. No, stop it. Fuck, dude. Let's go. I'm gonna die. I don't wanna die. Come on, baby. Let's go. He's fucking. Oh, fuck. Oh. I saw that the last second. I should have went into the pause menu and then healed up that way. I need some heavy combat armor is what I need. Alright. Well, let's do this. I'm good. That was a waste. Let's go. No, what the fuck? Let's go. Come on, kill the damn dog. You. Die, please. Alright, that's the legendary guy. I do have one grenade. Oh, shit. Alright, where's Rocket Launcher, man? Fuck. Get out of my way. I don't want to take out this guy just yet. Uh... <gasps> Screw it! Let's go! Come on! I need to watch my health. He's about to... You know, mutate in a second. There he goes. Sucks because now he's full of health again, but it's okay though. We'll take him out. These legendaries are tanky. Alright, let me go back. Oh, fuck, I'm stuck. And heal a little. Any grenades? Nope. Dance, where the hell are you, dude? I have you to help me. Alright. What were we shooting at again? I think we were shooting at the left leg. Let's go. Dance. Fuck. He hits hard, man. Oh, shit. That was close. Here. Dance, you keep talk, uh... Dealing with him, I'll take homeboy out. I'll take the missiles. Matter of fact, I'll take all of this. Fuck it. I still don't have any grenades, huh? This is a plasma? Alright, you're screwed, buddy. Oh, fuck. You're done.
Dunskis. I want I want my righteous authority back though. Uh, bats enhanced metal chest piece. I'll take that though. All right, we're good. Let's go. Uh, nothing in here. Nope. All right. So let's go around the corner and look what we found. Found the stockpile. Look at all these freaking fat men. And no, I'm not talking about myself. Definitely taking those since I've used up most of them. Where the hell's Dance? Pretty sure there's another one around here somewhere. No? Hmm, maybe not. Alright, fuck it, let's go. That's a lot of freaking... That's a big stockpile of fat man. Fat men. Or whatever. Let's see if we can catch up with Dance. Dance, come back here. I need you in my life, buddy. Oh, God, I'm stuck. Let's go. He hello. Dance, look at this place. You must hate these mutants as much as I do. Oh, absolutely. To you. Absolutely. Wiping them out was a pleasure. I wish all of mankind shared your sentiment. These monstrosities are just another example of man blindly taking a step forward only to wind up stumbling two steps back. Sure. I've been fighting for years, trying to put a stop to this madness. And just when I thought we were getting the upper hand, along come the synths. I've seen what these super mutants do to people. Can you imagine what the synths would do to us if they ever got the upper hand? It would be Armageddon repeated. And maybe Potentially. the end of everything that we hold dear. <sighs> Look, I don't mean to bore you with my rhetoric. I just want you to understand how important these missions are. Uh, no, nah, don't, don't be sorry, dude. Don't apologize. It reminds me why I'm doing this. Thank you, brother. It's good to know you're taking my advice to heart. Anyway, that's enough of that. What's important here is that you got the job done and secured these warheads. You should head back up to the Pridwin and talk to Maxon. I'm sure he'll want to debrief you as soon as possible. Dismissed. Yeah, come with me, though. Paladin Dance. Ready to continue our mission, soldier? Yes. Ready. Roger that. Good, come on, let's go. We can't fast travel out of here, so we're gonna have to take the elevator up. You in here with me, buddy? Nope, all right. What about now? Nope, all right, what about now? And now? All right, fuck it, let's go. Uh, I think he just came. Hello. Fucking magically appearing out of nowhere. Maxon's gonna be happy that we just got him like half a million freaking mini nukes. I was about to say, is this ever gonna be done? This is like the longest freaking elevator ride ever. Where am I? This way. Let's go. This is one of those things where Fallout 76 does superior uh, compared to Fallout 4 is the the ability to fast travel from indoors, man. That's such a valuable asset. I don't want to go retrace my steps out this building, you know? I just want to go straight to my objective point. Because now I have to upload three loading screens. I could have, if I would have, uh, from the bottom floor or whatever, from the bottom of the basement or whatever, I could have just fast traveled from there instead of loading screen from the basement and then from leaving the building and then now I have to freaking fast travel all the way back to the Pridwin. Yay me. <clears throat> Come on baby. Hey, I just realized this. That's the same stove from Fallout 76. Which kind of makes sense, of course. Fallout 76, the majority of it is just an asset flip, so. Which I get, I suppose. It's cheaper that way. 
Dance, I'm coming. I mean, not dance. Max in. See all these loading screens, dude? If I would've just came over here, I could've just went from Fort Strong, basement, straight to the Parid win, and then just indoors, and then that's basically it, because he's gonna be in the main floor, right here, in the back. Good, see? Hey, Maxon. Outstanding work at Fort Strong, soldier. Uh, I did it for the Brotherhood, man. It was an honor fighting for the Brotherhood. I'm glad you feel that way. Because our mission here has only just begun. In order to bring the Institute to its knees, we need to use every weapon at our disposal. I try to supply my soldiers with the best. That's why I'm giving you these. Signal grenades can call a cool. vertebrate to your location when you need aerial transport. Simply throw one to the ground, and the vertebrate will hone in on the unique electromagnetic smoke it emits. Once you're aboard, use the map on your pit boy to interface with the pilot's navigation system. So he'll be able to take you wherever you need. Uh, yeah, cool, man. Thank you, Elder. I'll make good use of them. I expect that you will. Now, I'm sure you're aware that Fort Strong was simply the first step towards the liberation of the Commonwealth. An even greater task lies ahead. Our latest intelligence tells us you've infiltrated the Institute and liberated a valuable holotape from their facility. I'm quite disappointed you chose to build the signal interceptor without the Brotherhood Knight. However, You've secured passage to and from their facility, which was one of our primary goals. So, I'm willing to overlook your lapse in judgment, since you've unexpectedly accelerated our plans. I now have two missions for you to complete. First okay. And foremost, I want you to bring that holotape to Proctor Ingram right away. There could be data vital to the success of our mission on that tape, so we can't afford to take any chances. The second part of your mission requires a bit of background to explain about 10 years ago the brotherhood began recruiting civilian scientists from the capital wasteland to assist with various projects during this process we were able to obtain the services of dr madison lee a noted mind in the field of nuclear engineering okay okay i i know who she is uh okay so that's fortunate that's fortunate yes it was securing useful resources during wartime is critical that said Dr. Lee's contributions to our cause were instrumental in maintaining order in the Capital Wasteland. Yep. After some time, she developed differences with the Brotherhood and exiled herself to the Commonwealth. We're fairly certain that her intent was to make contact with the Institute. Fairly certain? Uh, what kind of differences are we talking about? What sort of differences? Although she was working with the Brotherhood of Steel, she never formally joined as a scribe. After the Capital Wasteland was secured, she objected to the Brotherhood's continued military presence there. I think she assumed we would just walk away from it all. She was wrong. Your mission is simple. Once you're inside the Institute, we want you to track down Dr. Lee's whereabouts. If you find out that she's still alive, make contact with her and convince her to return to the Brotherhood of Steel. There's a special project we're working on, and it needs her attention. Yes, ma'am. Uh, Dr. Lee. What's this project that needs her attention? Dr. Lee previously worked on a potent weapon for the Brotherhood of Steel. We'd like her to continue where she left off. That's all I can tell you. Uh, I already know. Mission. And don't let anything they say sway you from your duty. Good luck, Knight. Ad Victorum. Did he tell me what the other mission is? Sir. You have your assignment, soldier. Move out. Um. Oh. Okay. Well, I think that's going to do it for this video, guys. In the next video, we're definitely going to do both of the missions that Elder Maxon wants us to do. Uh, so there's that. It, they're pretty short in nature. It's basically just going and retrieving a holotape and then talking to Madison Lee and convincing her to come over here. So it shouldn't be too difficult. Uh, the problem is, though, with the Madison Lee situation is that you have to have high charisma. Uh, how is my charisma anyways? Uh... Eight. So who knows? Maybe between this video and the next video, we might grind a little bit and just make it to ten, just to be sure, you know. But if you enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.